Last, last. Now everybody go to a breakfast. Shayo. Shayo. Choco bow for the presunto. Nothing to discuss. Cause I'm the poor boy. Fought and we got to What's good, y'all? Oh my god. Oh my god. It's Peyton. And I'm back with another video. We are vlogging at the airport. Luckily, I made this shit on time. I'm surprised that I did. They talking about the back cutoff was about to say fuck me. Well, what if I said fuck you to the back cutoff? So I just got to the airport and I just checked in for my flight to Aruba. And as you guys can see by the video, it's a birthday vlog. I'm a little tipsy. I took some shots before I left. It's fucking Wednesday, guys. It's really about to be my birthday. It's actually Tuesday, November 28th, but it's about to be Wednesday, November 29th. So it's almost my birthday. And we going to Aruba for this fucking travel vlog and I feel like this vlog is about to just be lit as fuck because why not? I am at LAX, just went through Fakeway TSA. Well, I guess I'm going through TSA right now and I took some shots before I left home so I'm kind of lit. <laughs> but it's good vibes. We're about to have good vibes this whole fucking video, y'all. I've been trying to bring good vibes to the vlog channel. But anyway, we're going to Aruba for my birthday. I'm 25 in like two hours. So by the time I land, I'm actually gonna be 25. So it's like basically I'm 25 already. Just from filming this video. Hey guys, so I just landed in Charlotte. And I have a three hour layover. So my next flight is not until 11 and it's 8.38 right now. I just got some Chick-fil-A and why do this shit feel cold? Like I'm not understanding. I'm excited to see what Aruba is like, honestly. Like, I don't really know. Let me not say I don't know what to expect, but like, yeah, I'm excited. But I got the spicy chicken biscuit sandwich with pepper jack cheese. Yeah, they fucking suck. I ain't even gonna hold y'all because Chick-fil-A usually melts the cheese. This cheese is not even melted and the sandwich is cold. Um, we gonna eat it anyway because I'm hungry as fuck. Okay, I'm vlogging right now. Wait, come say hi. I look a mess, but I'm come say hi. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm like literally vlogging in the moment right now. That's all like, that's so cool. Yes, and I show my friend. I'm like, I'm gonna Ah, thank you so much. You too. Thank you. I'm about to like scream. <laughs> uh, I'm going to Aruba. We are too. Really? Oh, that's so lit. I'm going for my, it's my birthday. Yes. This is crazy. Happy birthday. It's times like this that just make me just so happy and like heart filled. Like no way I'm eating my Chick-fil-A and I see a subscriber at the airport that's going to Aruba. Life just too good to be true sometimes, man. Y'all, so I get on the plane. Why well, don't have a window in my room? Now I can't show y'all my takeoff and my landing. I'm getting on the flight now. Um, let's see what time does it land? I think we oh we landed like four, and Aruba's like one hour ahead, meaning we landed three. Okay, when we get there at 4:30, Jordan's already gonna be there. Ikram's gonna get there at the same time as me and we're gonna take a tram to our resort we're staying at Tamarijan Aruba all-inclusive resort hopefully I'm saying it correctly it's supposed to be like a sister resort with DB Aruba Oh, 
for me. Uh, send me if you tell you I'm sorry. Just so it doesn't seem for me. Hey guys, so we finally got here. It's like 5.30 right now. We're about to check in. My camera's about to die. But um, we ended up just taking a shuttle. We ended up, well, actually we booked a shuttle earlier in advance to take us from the airport and bring us here. So we just got here. Now we're going to check in. And we look, you got to start getting ready fast because we have dinner reservations at 8 or 8.30. And this is my birthday dinner, basically. So I got to, like, look my best. So as soon as we check in, I'm about to start getting ready. The vibes seem cool. They seem very chill. Like this is, looks like a really laid back resort. Oh, uh, we made it! Oh my gosh, I can't believe. I can't believe it. We got some shots. Shot, shot, shot. Off the walk in. We in Aruba, y'all, with the vibes. Okay, cheers to Payton. Woo! Cheers. So, here's our room, guys. It is a little small, but I like it still. This is a nice bathroom here. Shower. Ooh, this is so cute. I haven't seen them right here. Is this your friend? Hey, y'all. Hey! Prepare to be sick of me, because I'm about to be right here on the ground. Yeah, y'all, look at this hot ass outfit that I have on. I'm ready to take this shit off and take a shower. Well, yeah, I'm about to start getting ready, y'all. Yes, we're getting lit. Happy birthday. Woo! Yeah, happy birthday, my bitch. We're getting ready to go to dinner, y'all. So, two hours later, and I'm ready. Say hi. We're going to Azuro, which is like a cool little Italian spot. Okay guys, so we're about to call the taxi to our reservation. We're it's late, like, we're but it's a Wednesday. Night. Like, we're about to be up there on the Wednesday. And then we got us. Drop the roof and let the smoke clear. Drop the roof and let the smoke clear. I got diamonds moving to the stars in both ears. Dice rolling on the last biggest trips and die. So it's 1.25 a.m. and we've decided that we're gonna open this fucking gold bottle. We originally opened this gold bottle so that I could pop it tonight in my gold dress. But <sighs> I'm just gonna go and get another gold bottle tomorrow. So let me tell you guys really quickly. There was a giant fucking cockroach in our room. <laughs> there was a giant fucking cockroach in our room that fucked up everything. 
because we were supposed to walk to the bar and come back with some drinks. But we didn't even go up, go to the bar because we had to wait for somebody that worked here to come and kill the fucking roach. So, after all that stress, I feel like I might as well just drink this bottle and then just get another one tomorrow. We got to, like, interlock our legs and, like, shake the ass. So, okay, come on. We're going to... Let's do it outside. I mean, I'm going to pop the... It was at this moment he knew. He fucked up. Oh, my God! What the fuck? Bitch! What the fuck? What the fuck? Did you make a boost out of yourself? Me. Look at it. Oh my god! Why did that just happen? What the That's fuck? The I didn't fuck even touch out. it. Okay. She did. The next day. So today we're doing the. Uh, Hold on, guys. What are we doing? Y'all, I'm so out of it. Why did we finish this bottle last night? I don't know what I was thinking, and I'm so sick and nauseous right now. I need to like down like some ice water. But um, we're doing like a little private boat party, okay. I should have put you somewhere where no one can find you. Man, she's not in the sticks with nothing around you. Katie, Texas, Dallas, Texas, you know a different environment. You got desires. I know, I know. You got desires. I know, I know. You got desires. I feel amazing. We're out here celebrating an amazing friend's 25th birthday, quarter century. We've been celebrating birthdays together, y'all, since we were 17 turning 18. That shit is crazy. Almost 10 years. Real ones. Real ones. We've been together for almost 10 years. Almost 10 years. Real ones. Real ones. Real ones. We came up from the classic triple dorms to Aruba. Bitch, hello. You've been with us since the bunk bed. You were the best day that. We made it. And we're only 25. We got a doctor. We got a lawyer. Period. We got an amazing girl. Period. Another amazing girl. <laughs> the Rubens fuck with all the party ladies. <laughs> you feel it, Sydney? Feeling great. We're in Aruba. We're having a great time. The sun is shining. The wind is blowing. I want another pasty. Some of y'all, no, a lot of y'all, I feel like majority of my viewers know you. You're sitting in the captain's seat. I know, that's okay. I'm taking up your, your seat. Okay, okay. You're in captain now. Some of y'all know um Jordan, but I feel like no, y'all haven't met Alex and Cindy. But these are my great, great, great friends from college days. I mean, if you watch the old college, all the way like, back, 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 right. The day, they were there. They were there. We were just trying. Right. Right. Let me say this. How do you feel? I feel great. I got my realest bitches out here with me for my birthday. It's hard to get bitches to go on a trip for real. So y'all ain't going to Aruba. Y'all ain't going to Aruba, Aruba, Aruba for real. Bitches ain't even. No, bitches can't even spell Aruba. Bitches can't even spell Aruba, and we in fucking Aruba vacationing with my bitches. Look at in the middle of the ocean. Look at this fucking view, bitch. They don't want you to come. They don't. They don't even. Y'all don't even want to be here for real. I love this guy, life. This I'm loving life. I'm loving life. That, you just gotta love life. Period. That's all you can do. Shot o'clock. And a shot to that. A shot to living life. Big 25. Living life. Hard work paying off. Big 25. Shout out to my prefrontal cortex development. Okay. If you see this, take a shot right now. If you're not taking a shot right now, we don't like you. If you can't what you even watching this vlog for? If you can't take a shot right now, drink some water. What the fuck? Yeah, drink some water. If you know you're gonna try, at least drink some water. Please. Take a sip or take a hit of the blood. Which I wish we had. Nice guys always finish off where they started. They shop for you wanted things and you got it. They shop for I want it smoke and I got it. They shop for Yeah, we give thanks that we need it the most. We have to give thanks that we really 
another restaurant because yeah, I feel so bad I went to the restaurant, restaurant that we were supposed to go to closes at 10 and it's fucking 9 43. today's ootv the dress is from <laughs> i'm gonna put it right here <laughs> the dress is from there same bag same shoes from yesterday because girl let me get a spin i don't got time for the morning but it's giving birthday vibes so the dress is giving birthday guys oh my god i don't know how i'm up and alive but we successfully finished getting ready for this clear kayak photo shoot in which our reservation was supposed to be at 11 o'clock but they switched it to 10 o'clock today because yesterday like we were supposed to do that boat thing yesterday day and the clear kayak yesterday but they switched it around and then i peeped they switched our times as well which is dumb because i don't know whatever That's so cool. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> 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 Interrupt our program to bring you this important message. to the hotel dinner called Red Carrot. Even though we're probably like 40 minutes late, so we're late. still gonna go see if we're gonna go eat. Because we need to. Yeah. So we can get lit. Lit! Cause tonight we're going out. We keep missing it now. We keep getting lit in the day and sleeping all day. Can't hang. Who's sleeping? I slept a little bit. I slept. This, today was the only day I took a nap this whole time that I've been. I'm not really taking no nap, which is part of now.
20 minutes later. <laughs> Aside from this ranch tasting like mayonnaise, I don't know what else. We don't go that. But I still love Aruba. The niggas was a little racist, but. Okay. The next day. I don't want pull no trigger. I just want me. What's up, man? I don't want no wahala, no wahala, no wahala, no wahala, no wahala, no no wahala. All right, y'all. So today we're doing horseback riding, and I'm on a horse right now. And I just broke my purse, so I'm kind of sad. But I think the horse is eating something. Animals make me nervous. Say hi, y'all. Smile and wave. Ikra. Yeah, you were guys. This all one's day. John. Yes. John. Glad we did not do the two hour one because my thighs would have been burning, burned off. A few moments later. Okay guys, so this is our last day out here. We about to go to the dinner at Ginger, which is another like on site restaurant. It's supposed to be like Asian food. It's supposed to be Asian food. And then after we go and do that, we're gonna go to the club. Today was a really long day. The horseback riding honestly drained the fuck out of me. Then we ended up going to like the DV pool bar. Um, Basically, the way that this resort is set up, um, Tamarin and DV are like sister resorts. So you can go to all like the all-inclusive spots over there and they can come to all of the all-inclusive spots over here. But yeah, honestly, I'm so sad we're leaving tomorrow. I wish we, I honestly am kind of like regretful that I didn't like plan to end this trip off on a Monday. Cause I feel like Sunday is late. Like every everybody we've been talking to today been telling us about shit we can do tomorrow and like the clubs we can go to tomorrow. And I'm like, damn. Which we low key did kind of come up on a fucked up time of the week. Cause we came like in the middle of the week instead of on the weekend. And I feel like places like this is like shit getting lit on the weekend. Cause yesterday when we went to the club, that shit was lit as fuck. And I think the club gonna be lit as fuck again tonight. We need that dessert for the F, even though it's all in. Yeah, no thank you. Lunch is what is this? A-R-U-B-A-I-N. A-R-U-B-A-I-N. That's what I am. 
quick one hour layover in JFK and then after my flight I just ended up Ubering home. I had a great time y'all. I don't want to make the ending of this video too long because I don't really have nothing bad to say like overall with my recap the resort we stayed at was really really nice. It was Tamarine all-inclusive resort. I would definitely go back to Aruba. Um, the clubs that we went to were also lit. Like I said if I could have if I would have known I would have picked for us to leave on Monday instead of Sunday because there was like I guess more nightlife to do on Sunday um but overall I had a great time like the clubs that we went to were lit I mean South Beach was the most lit club I feel like going to Aruba and trying to party is better for like the weekend but obviously I wanted to celebrate on my actual birthday so I did it I did it from Wednesday to Sunday um which I don't regret I just wish we ended up leaving on Monday instead of sunday so i could have had like one more night to do a different club because we went to south beach back to back and we did hidden and this other club but it wasn't the same because south beach was like playing south beach is what all the locals were calling urban which means like black people's there so yeah it wasn't just black people but they were playing like black music urban music hip-hop r&b and i really like that because it was lit and they had hookah vibes we were smoking drinking met some good people danced had a lot of fun so overall i would say i love aruba and i would definitely go back i'm like aruba's about to be my new jamaica only thing is the flight is way longer like i think jamaica is actually even closer than aruba but aruba is in the middle of the caribbean so i don't i didn't really expect it to be too close but um i would definitely go back food was good so honestly i give it a really high i'm gonna say i'm gonna give it like a 10 out of 10 honestly the only thing i wish we got like a floor balcony view but we got a second floor which was pr practically just as good the beach was right there it was so beautiful shout out to tamarind divi um i definitely recommend going if y'all want to go to aruba in the caribbean it is kind of a far flight i don't remember how much everything was i want to say it was like our budget everybody's budget was like 1500 dollars for the resort and i'm pretty sure it was cheaper than that like so for the price that we paid i think we got a really good deal because i've paid more for less and, um so i hope you guys enjoy coming on my vacation for my 25th birthday with me i actually like when i tell y'all i really feel like my prefrontal cortex is loaded in i really do like no regrets at all y'all but i'm back home in the comfort of my own crib i'm ready to get in my bed it's literally four o'clock in the morning right now <sighs> i had a time y'all it was lit aruba was fun it was great and i'm so happy that my friends came out for me shout out to jordan alex sydney egram we had a great time. Y'all know I love traveling. I love the traveling people. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next vlog. Comment down below and let me know what y'all was thinking about this vlog, about this resort, and about our full itinerary. Shout out to Jordan, my best friend, literally. Like, if it wasn't for her, none of this shit would have happened because this bitch is the best trip planner in the fucking world. Like, I t I'm telling her she needs to do this shit for a living. Like, y'all be in my in my comments asking me how I get all this shit together is literally thanks to my best friend. Like, <laughs> she does it all for me. Shout out to y'all for watching. I'm gonna see y'all in my next video. And let me know what y'all think in the comments down below. And don't forget to like and don't forget to subscribe if you watch this video all the way through and you're not subscribed. What the hell is wrong with you? Come on. Go. Hit that button. All right, y'all. Bye.